Hey folks, uh, depending upon where you're watching from, happy Valentine's Day. Well, that's when I'm recording this. Happy Valentine's Day, uh, happy Super Bowl weekend, uh, happy winter. Um, but I just wanted to kind of make this video to kind of really talk about um, not everybody, and I, I get it, and not everybody... And, and I, I don't want this to be a negative, but damn, I had the slowest weekend in two two years, and you know, and it's tough. It's tough to you got to you got to get yourself motivated. You got to push yourself, and um, so I'm going to talk about those things in this video. So I hope you like it. I hope you guys give me thumbs up and uh, watch and enjoy and uh, comment below. I want I want people more to interact and uh, that I can network with and. Um, we're all in this together as far as um, if you're a reseller, you know, the networking part of understanding, you know, what, what things we can do different. And I'm trying to watch others and learn. So, all right. Hope you enjoy this video. Let's go. Yeah, I was tapping on the uh, the desk there. I just realized as I went back and watched that one uh, first one minute opener there. But no, I had I had the slowest sales this week. I didn't do a hundred dollars Saturday and Sunday, and that was between uh, Amazon and eBay. And yet, in the last thirty days, I'm up a hundred and twenty percent on eBay. I'm looking at the chart right here now. I sold 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Only 15 days, uh, honestly. Um, I just went and picked up. One good thing today is I went up and picked. I have to, I'm going to be working on that video. I was going to record outside today, and it was 9 degrees. So between trying to hold the, the phone and carry all the stuff and lug it into the car, um, I bought lots of diecast cars and records and uh, all kinds of stuff that I I, I bought that I really I had no more room <laughs> in the uh, the car and I have a I have a big car I have a Crown Vic I didn't need to rent a van for this load but still it was a and uh, I had to drive about 35 miles away and load it up all myself and the lady wouldn't give me the totes so luckily I bought some totes and uh, a couple cardboard boxes but it was a matter of transferring stuff around and records are heavy and uh one good thing is i sold a so within i i saw an elvis record and within 10 minutes of listing it i uh sold it so i'm going through the records and you know that that's the issue a lot of times and i'm going to talk about that in my other video is 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 just paying the right price for stuff because you know everybody wants to say well you got 200 yeah well 150 of them aren't worth nothing you know or, or barely worth anything that you know, it's really got to be a popular singer or somebody that's really interested in the shape uh, plays in fact, uh, you know, factors into, you know, all that stuff. But um, where I'm hurting at is Amazon compared to last year is, you know, Amazon right now is down about 50 percent from last year. And just a lot of the stuff that I was selling and you got to keep in mind last year. Um, people were still getting um, monthly checks, so there was a lot of more money floating around. And now, now what's happening is I think there's a lot of people that are in my and and the price is being lowered. And Amazon themselves, I've seen so many. I've seen I've seen listings get deactivated over four cents. It, it it's crazy, and I and this is why I'm trying to up my game as far as uh, listing on eBay. Now this video, I'm not sure when it will come out. Um, I have, my last video actually that I have out right now is about Ollie's and, and and doing retail arbitrage. Sometimes being a smaller channel, when I say smaller, 3,500 subs at the time that I'm making this video, 
Um, I, I don't want to flood it where people's like, well, I missed that one. Oh, well, I'm watching him today. So I'm really trying to do two to three videos. Right now, only two videos a week. I mean, I've been averaging probably 10 with, with uh, two lives a month. Um, but just trying to allow, I'm looking at the click-through rate for that. And that it's, it's getting watch time, but still it's not getting, you know, um, you know, I like to say, you know, couple hundred but i like to see it in the thousands of course and gain some traction so i want to thank everybody that did watch the rally roots interview that was exciting for me and it was great hanging out with them and um actually we talked about their coming north about meeting up with them so i'm excited to meet them in person and you know i got a busy schedule ahead but you know honestly it's 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 tough to sometimes get motivated after a hundred dollar weekends I always seem to do better personally. I know some people might do better when they're slower because they're like, hey, I got to I gotta get out and, and do something. For me, I guess I'm kind of the opposite. I, when it's slower, I'm like, oh, what a, you know, I just, I'm not as motivated. Now, when I'm busier and I'm forced to, to you know, I know what I got to do. I know I got to ship this. I know I got to do that. And the money's coming. And I, I always, that's just always probably been my, my personality that I always seem to do better. Uh, I always do better in, in when things are bigger and, and running right and, and the money's coming in and, you know, and, and when, let's be clear, this is a business, eBay, Amazon, YouTube, you know, and it's all about cash flow and you got to make sure that you're, um, you know, have that cash flow. I mean, I even, I, I don't know if you guys know or not, but in the, who've watched me, but before I really started selling on Amazon full time, I used to be in the restaurant business, but when we closed the restaurant, uh, due to health issues and the way things were going, I started doing Instacart, a grocery delivery service. And I still was doing it from time to time, but I hadn't done it last year, probably for about seven, eight months straight. And I took I took like two, three orders already this year. And I decided this week I, I'm going to do some orders, you know, because I was slower that I, you know, one good thing about it is I know what I'm going to make because you could pick your orders and, um, I, it was tough today, though, at nine degrees. I did do one order. I was going to do three, but a lot of times I was just 15 miles away from the store. By the time I thought about doing it, somebody else quick grabbed it. So I think there was too many shoppers wanting to. And then once I filled up my car with that, um, I, I, I tried to, you know, be efficient. In other words, when I was out shopping and I was near that person's house, I'm like, okay, I'm going to pick up that stuff. Um, just like I, you know, I go scrapping or go to the junkyard. I try to, you know, not make it unnecessary, uh, trips because with the price of gas and everything. And I think, you know, in this past weekend, I think a lot has to do with Valentine's day, the Super Bowl, the stock market, uncertainty with, you know, Russia, the price of gas. And, um, so, you know, there's a lot of those, but that I, I there's a lot of things I'm working on that I'm, I, I don't want to say I'm taking advantage, but when it is cold, there's no garage sales and there's no yard sales. Yeah, you can look for deals on Facebook Marketplace. Big deals are tough there, too. A lot of people like to sell. They're sort of selling sort of like eBay, you know, the words, the prices and stuff. It's, it's not as always easy finding bulk deals um, like I did today. But I am I, I last weekend, yeah, about 10, 12 days ago, went and purchased some shelving units at Sam's Club and I, I need to get set up so that if I'm out, basically, you know, let's, you know, be just just being a better. I I think the potential. I I like to see myself do forty grand this year on eBay. You know, that's only ten thousand dollars every every three months, and um, I I think definitely can do it with the right mix of stuff. Now my my pro. I mean, I have seven hundred. Let me look now. I just listed 10 more records. I have 730. It's funny because I had 730 the other day, but I got to keep in mind, I sold I sold some stuff. So sometimes that can be work against you. Like, wait a minute, I just had 730. How do I have seven? Well, if you sold 15 items in the, in the past, you know, week or whatever, um, duh, that's what, you know, <laughs> that's what happens. So I do appreciate you guys supporting me, and I hope you guys will continue to support me and watch my journey in the life of reselling, I'm really trying to give you guys an honest, um, the, the good, the bad, the ugly, the ups and downs, and, and really that you guys watch me also grow 
um, better and be a better. I've been on, I've been on eBay since 1998, but the last two years, a lot of my focus really was on Amazon, probably 95% of it. Um, and and there's reasons why to sell on Amazon, and there's reasons not. And I'll talk about that probably in future videos and stuff. But my my goal is for, by the summer is to do about three videos a week, doing the garage sales, estate sales, yard sales, flea markets, and storage. You know, get back into buying storage units. I just bought a. a, a I actually have a, um, a, a pod on my property now because I got just got a whole bunch of stuff and I'm working on that video. I went to a large garage sale in the fall and I'm trying to um, that video footage I would save until after the first year and sometimes I you know what I need to do and that's what people don't realize when you do YouTube if you don't want to release the footage for a while and um, at least get it get it ready and just to add some stuff happen and so now it's like I got to go back and really like, okay, yeah, and I sold a bunch of that stuff already. So I did good with that. I went up to Lake George. So um, if you guys haven't checked out too, do me a favor. Check out if you want to support the channel. We have no memberships or nothing like that. But if you guys want to support the channel and uh, I'm having these, uh, I have these new t-shirts, pet these. The Traveling Picker. They're $17.95. Now, I only got large, extra large, 2X, and 3X. I don't have any smalls and mediums. Um, I did. I will have more of those. I did at Christmas time. I sold some of them out. But if, you, if you're interested, it's $17.95 shipped. Um, go to my website, thetravelingpicker.com. I'll put the uh, the link in the description. I make 5 bucks a shirt, you know, after shipping and stuff like that. If you want to support the channel uh, and myself that way, I'd greatly appreciate it. And... Um, well, that's about it. So um, I'm hoping that it's not a sign of things to come. And I'm, obviously, I'm not going to give up. Uh, I, and I do like the fact that I could still do... I'm going to still do Instacart from here from time to time to make some extra money. And there's nothing wrong with that, with making extra money. And um, and now putting these... I'm, looking, I'm here looking at in my office at the warehouse area that, you know, i putting these shelves and doing a lot of this stuff... There's still more things I need to do because people don't realize when you have these piles and these totes, you're moving from one end to the other. You gotta, you know, move. It's 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 it's, it's time consuming, and um, I I need to. I like a mix of affordable stuff, and um, we're gonna be having uh, we're doing the reselling show on on with the eBay every two weeks, and um. If you're interested in that, that's $10 for the whole year. We feature your store. We actually use the money and give it away to viewers, or we buy something in somebody's store. We've had guests come on, so we got. I was talking to other guests. And the, the 2022 Spotlight guests, you know, are, are really, um, I don't want to say bigger channels, but, I mean, we've had Rally Roots on. We had Miss Missouri, Rachel Strickland uh, on, and we got a, a big guest book for next month. And, I only do one of them a month, and I, it's an hour, and um, I book them out, and um, I basically make, make a commitment with the person that comes on, typically three or four months in advance. Um, so I'm excited about that. Uh, again, I, I want to keep this short. I, I apologize, but I appreciate you guys' support. And uh, like I said, do me a favor. Like A lot of times you get 150, 200 people watching, and you can't get more than five comments. Comment. Say something. Just say that you're here or... Or how your eBay is doing, and, and um, appreciate it because those comments and those thumbs up they, they help the algorithm. Just like on Facebook, the more people like something or comment on a photo that you post or Instagram, the more that pushes it up into the algorithm and and, and pushes it out there, and, and more people find me and will support me. So um, my goal is to hit 10,000 subscribers this year. I'm hoping so. I'm hoping, I'm really hoping that I could, you know, um, I mean, I'm growing. I mean, I, I think I gained about 150 subscribers between uh, the Steve Rakin interview that I was on his show and um, uh, Rally Roots. And I did gain some in December from hanging out with Jeebus family. So I, I'm constantly trying to stay busy and, you know, being the traveling picker, I have a lot of plans to be uh, traveling back and forth between Florida and down to Tennessee, the Carolinas, and stuff in the next uh, six to nine months. So I hope you guys will watch my journey, and thanks for your support. Have a good day. You got it.